Okay, I'm bored. You're bored because it was his part sent into what Deku was Tai Lung. And yeah, I can tell. So you've been waiting for this part. So let's pick up with Deku going home with, you know, Viper and Tigress. When he gets there, he knocks on the door and goes, just like, go away. I'm waiting for my son. We say, I am your son. Bullshit. Then she sees him and tackles his ass, almost making his head hit the rail. It's like, Mama, I didn't, I didn't do anything wrong. Why are you punishing me? Like, what, punishing you? I'm hugging you. It's like, yes, and it's embarrassing in front of my friends. Like, friend, she sees tigers and fiber. Is like, what's with you in bringing women here? All of a sudden, it's like. What, what do you mean? Yeah, got gray she just she appears. Like, like, wait, is, is that really easy? Like, then she sees him like, who are, who, who, who are them? Who is them? Don't tell me you, like, no, uh, no, I haven't done anything. <sighs> Despite one of them actually trying something. Like, got gray like, what? Like, which, which one was it? Oh, that uh, pussy cat with the big knockers you see right there. It's like, uh, mine are big too. It's like, co compared to hers? Nah, nah, nah. And Gil just smacks him upside the head. Like, Show some respect, boy. I trained you better than I trained you better than this. Like, train me? You mean raise? No, I train. I had to train you. Yeah, like I'm a pet. Like, well, with some of your tendencies, do you know how long it took me to get you to come to wear shirts? Wait, speaking of which, where is your shirt? You got crazy. Like, wait, shirt? Sure, don't you know his hero costume is really just pants? She glares daggers at Deku. Like, really? Let's listen. <clears throat> I'm I'm just more comfortable not wearing that, especially with, I don't like wearing shoes and socks are very uncomfortable. We can make you socks. You know this. But I feel so wrong. Uh huh. Either way, who who were these women you have brought before us? Um, tigers and viper. They were uh, prisoners there too. Okay. She just looks at viper and tigers, just look eyeing them up and down. So, what are they really doing here? I want them to stay here with us in the guest room. So, Gagori's like, fuck that noise. Which tigers like, what? What's wrong with us staying here? Because I do not trust you around easy. Oh, really? Are you sure it's not because you want to spend more time with them as a bitch? What? You heard me. Okay. Deku? You better tell this cat that I will skin her. Uh, oh really? You, you you really think I'm scared of you, little girl? Oh yeah, I know how to skin a cat. Yeah, good thing you're invisible, cause I I could suspect you have a full bush under there. I'm like, <gasps> hey, how dare you? Like, Deku's just like. No, she doesn't. She, she actually shaves quite well. Like, ah. Inko's like, Nani? Like, yeah, before, before uh, me being able to see her, her hero costume was just some boots and gloves. Like, Tigress is like, <laughs> so what, you're a nudist? Like, no, no, it was just... No one was ever able to see me before, and I 
didn't expect someone like him coming along. So, oh, so that's why you're so protective of him. What do you mean? He's like, you love the fact that you can finally be seen by someone and really have confirmation that you're beautiful. I. It doesn't matter. Izuku, Izuku still cares about you. But for how long is he yet to be seen? Gakure, she's steamy. She's pissed off. If you could see her face, it would pretty much be the typical anime you know, uh, rifle face she's making. You can see the lightning sparks between them. Viper is just like, oh, I can't believe this is actually happening. Then she actually helps Izuku and Inko up. So, um, shall we uh, go inside? They just leave Tigers and Hagakure out there to argue. You can shut the door in their faces. And Viper pretty much gives the Inko the whole rundown of everything. Leaving out certain details, which Deku is more than happy to fill in for. Like... Then he goes like, so, so what you're saying is you can now give and take quirks. That's yeah, correct. And that little kitten over there arguing with your friend stole a kiss from you while you were unconscious. That is also correct. Okay. Give me my butter knife. Like, what? Like, give me my butter knife. Because I'm about to skin a cat. And I want something dull enough so I can take my time. So, Mom, just just calm down. You don't have to do that. Why not? It, even, I don't care if you like her. It, it, you did not give your A-OK -okay to do such a thing. That may be true, but... She's not a bad person. It was just her... Mm. It was just her cycle. What? I don't remember. I did research on other big cats besides what I am, and it was just her main cycle. Oh. But that still doesn't excuse the fact that. Hey, Mom. Calm down. Believe me. She, she is not. She is not taking advantage of me. Because Viper was there. And then she glanced at Viper like, Oh, so you watched and let it happen? I, I, and he, yes, but it was only because he wasn't really waking up and they, she got worried and tried to, Oh, so you wanted to be all, she wanted to be uh, the, the prince that wakes up the princess. Wait, hold it. What, what do you mean by princess? I, I ain't no sleeping beauty. Yeah, Viper's like, oh, you kind of were, at least in her eyes. Yeah, don't, better, better watch it, because right now she's glaring at both of you. Yeah. Oh, good point. Well, either way, Miss Inko, yes, we do plan on staying here, because apparently your son has made a deal with a, a friend from that we used to hang out with. From beyond the grave. What? Yeah, I went to the spirit realm to talk with their best friend, and yeah, he actually helped me break my, you know, restraints. Huh. Okay. And what you're saying is that you made a deal with him to. Give them a place to stay and everything, uh, know a better life and all that. Like, yeah, pretty much. Okay. Well, I hope you you girls are good at housework. Like, what? Like, yes, you you are going to be working here. Since you're living here rent free, you are going to do some housework. I'm pretty sure you're a little old to go to high school she, she's just starting to admit some bloodlust because since Tigers just stole her son's kiss 
possibly his first kiss. She doesn't, she doesn't know if he's kissing anyone else. He, at least not yet. <laughs> Where's Deck? He's like, okay, okay. Um, I think that that's a that's a good trade. Don't don't you don't you uh viper? Come on now. Then her duck ray and tigers just show up and like, okay, we made an agreement. I'm like what? What what, what agreement? Like, we have agreed that you will would be um not only letting us stay here, but she wants to stay here too. He goes like, what does bitch say? She she looks at her guy great, but she is wearing something. But it's just like, what? When when were you going to tell me of this? Like we we just did. Oh, honey, I am going to end up killing someone. Izuku, you better get your friend here, because right now I am not in the mood for no jokes. Right, right, right. <clears throat> Agakure, first of all, I made a deal with her friend so they could stay here. Second, you can't just assume that just because they're staying here that I'm going to uh, ride the upside down bicycle, go to a first cow girl or none of that. Like, wait, how do you know about those positions? Wait, how do you know about them? Um, research. Uh huh. Like um, also your room. It's kind of. Oh God, you've been in my room. Yes. And he runs. He runs to his room just to see. You. Okay, okay, okay. Um, please, please, please don't don't tell me she's found my collection. Where she where she finds a. Some playboys with a uh, midnight as well as I don't lay on the cover. Like, oh, thank you, Jesus. They have, they have not been tainted. And when he doesn't notice Hagakure is st standing right there, it's like, oh, so that's where they were. Like, don't tell anyone. Not even my mom knows that, that I have these. Hmm, let me stay, and maybe we won't have to worry about it this oh oh you sly fox no i'm no i don't have an ammo quirk you know what i meant i know come on time to tell your mom that i'm staying here oh damn okay fine fine they head back into the living room and like okay yeah she can stay here what? Hell, you, you you were so, um, what, what, what made you change your mind? <laughs> oh, let's just say we made an agreement. Well, well, there was separate uh, rooms and, you know, just no funny business. Like, uh-huh, how can I be so sure of that? Um, yeah, can't, you just going to trust us. Okay, you are dismissed. Um, understood. Ingo just grabs a rocker, a guy grazed on and says, You found his porn mags, haven't you? Like, oh, yes. He doesn't know that you've already found them. So, yeah, they made perfect leverage. <sighs> you are actually more like a villain here. Eh, I like your son, and he will be mine. Despite certain obstacles in my way just glaring at tigers <laughs> and when Deku's announced to be found and safe and sound everyone is happy as could be UA is actually able to open up oh yes they closed down because of this they did he didn't want to risk people thinking he didn't care about a student being kidnapped. So he actually halted classes and everything, only really doing online courses. But yeah, no hero, no hero uh, lessons 
because that has to be hands on. And the UA Sports Festival is coming up next. And which is out well, without the Bandy Jays, since Deku pretty much clapped everyone, let them know about. Manet, Manet was just asking, okay, uh, Midoriya, um, I, I need to ask you a favor. What do you want, you fucking perv? Like, all I, all I want is some of your fur to make a pillow out of. I was like, a pillow? Yes. <sighs> How much of my fur do you want? Um, he just gives him uh, some estimates. He's like, oh, hell no. I know exactly what you're going to do. No, no, it's not like that. Yeah, well, you, you're playing on making a fucking body pillow, aren't you? I... I, I knew it. Fuck no, you are not getting any of my. Bro. Who God knows what you're gonna do with that pillow? It's nothing bad. I just want to go and sleep with it. Exactly. That's what I'm scared of. Oh come on, man! Don't be like that. What's the worst thing that could happen? The worst thing that could happen is that you're gonna have to end up cleaning that pillow every after every night. Everyone's hearing this, like, like they're just glaring at Manel, just like, oh my god, how are, how are you still in this class? At least Rob, and Robbie and the other girls just glaring daggers at Deku, like, what, what, what did I do? It's what you didn't do that we're pissed about. But, what do you mean? We're pissed that you didn't even mention us to your mom. And you only talked to her about Hagakure. You mentioned her a lot, saying how beautiful she was. Well, in my defense, I the only one I could really see her, and um, I have been helping her a lot with her quirks. What? You didn't show them, did you? No. I kind of wanted it to be a surprise. I was surprised. You are screwing me over, woman. J just show them. Fine. Whatever. And when she just starts to look more tangible, she's like, wait. Oh my god, no wonder he calls you beautiful. So, like, yeah. I, I wanted to surprise you guys at the sports festival. And then, you know, the USJ happened, Deku got kidnapped, it was too much. Huh. But still, that does not excuse what you not say anything about us to your mother. Like, um, it's, it's, it's not that big a deal to me, it's just, hell, I've spent more time with Hagakure than any of you. That doesn't make us feel any better. Right now, you belong to all of us. Excuse me? Yes. You are ours now. You spent too much time with her. So, yes, it's our turn. I can't do that. I'm going to have to spend a lot more time with Hagak Ray anyway. What do you mean by that? I... Um... Training. Yeah, training. Training. Through through glancing at it, I got crazy. Like, oh yeah, we're gonna do a lot of training, aren't we? And they are just <laughs> glaring daggers at Deku, saying, "What the fuck she mean by that?" Uh, well, we, we're gonna see if we can actually turn her quirk off completely. You, you see that that way she doesn't have to worry about uh people bumping into her stuff like that. You know. <laughs> Oh, I thought you meant more of our late night training that we'll be have be able to do now. Like, what is she talking about? It's like, um, um, uh, a sleepover. That's she. Her she asked her parents if she could uh, stay over from time to time, at least on the weekends, for you know training. He's looking at guy crazy. Like, He's lying. I'm. I'm. Here's what's really going down. I'm staying with him now. And, and Momo is looking at Deku like, <clears throat> they, 
let me get this straight. So you, you living with him? I'm like, yes, I am. I'm like, Anything else you wants to know? Like, well, he also has two other older women uh, staying with him. I'm like, oh my God, woman, are you, you trying to ruin me? Like, no, I'm not trying to wo- ruin you. I'm just trying to. Um, Make sure people know where I stand. I don't want... You're going to be standing somewhere soon enough. You don't have to tease me, Zuku. We can wait till we get home. Damn it! Why are you doing this? Because it's entertaining. And I like making the other girls jealous. You're trying to get me killed, aren't you? Seriously, with what you survived, I doubt anything can kill you now. <sighs> Whatever. Either way, uh, when is class gonna be over? Uh, as I was saying, uh, I, don't, I don't know when, because right now I'm enjoying the show. So. I saw. Come on, man. What what happened to the bro code? You're supposed to be you're supposed to be on my side here true but i'm just kind of enjoying your life going crazy right now that's no excuse you're my teacher as well man come on you put me all for order and all that like, um true but I, i'm enjoying this like, you you're becoming a sadist aren't you oh yes yes i am and you are to blame for that young midoriya <sighs> and Deku, he's just trying to explain everything from uh, leaving out the fact that he, uh, he, he, she uh, blackmailed him to reveal to his mom his porn stash, in which she, he's trying to leave that part out. But they're, they're just thinking, yeah, okay, we, we, can, we can let this slide, but you better keep her mouth shut. Or else we're gonna have to cut and visit bitch. She she just grunts at that. Like, oh, that's the second time I've been called that, and I I really don't like it. So, like what? Oh yeah, the one of the other women, Tigress. She called her that first. Yeah, it's very upsetting. Well, how could I not be upset? She stole your first kiss, didn't she? Like what? Like, yeah, apparently when he was unconscious, she did who knows what to him. And Deck is like, no, don't you dare to say that. She didn't do anything. So like, she, who said she was my first kiss? It's like, really? It's like, so who was it? Dick's like, none of your, none of your own fucking business. Bog girl just looks at him and is like, that motherfucker. He better not have done what I think he did. <laughs> got, got to a while ago. Let's say some years. Deku was 12. And he was hanging out with Bakugo. Then Macy went to. Have, Macy uh, showed up. To pe- take Bakugo home. And Deku says. I'll miss you. Get on. I'll miss you. Please. Uh, I'm, get, get, come here for a second. I'm buzzy. Easy to Okay, goodbye, kiss. Like, what? Like, come on, just a goodbye, kiss. That's all I want. I'm, I don't get to see you very often. So. Izuku, like, yes. Like, don't. He goes warn me about your tendencies. Like, uh, tendencies. What? What tendencies might that be? Like, whatever. Like, and he, she gives him a kiss on the cheeks. Like. That's just, that's the only thing you're getting. Uh, believe me, it's worth it. And Deku just, rather Deku, he's blushing. And, and Deku probably goes like, oh, he didn't. I'm like, then they try to get his attention. He's like, like, hey, Izuku, Izuku, wake up. I'll be gone, Miski. I told you. Like, and he's like, oh. Bakugo is losing his shit. He's like, why did you, why did my mom's name leave your lips? It's like, uh, <clears throat> you know what? 
I'm, I'm feeling a little sick right now. Uh, I thought you said, uh, when, when's the sports festival? Uh, it's in two days. Okay, um, I'm, I'm, I'm out. <laughs> he runs out of there, but the girls in Bakugo just running after him saying, you are going to die today. I don't care how strong your fur is, you are going to die. We are going to kill you personally. And we're going to chop you up and turn you into sashimi. Say, oh, damn. I, I love sushi, too. I want, doesn't mean I want to be sushi. And he is running towards the exit. Just then, he sees and goes like, Mom, what are you doing here? Like, well, just, you, just for, you just forgot your lunch. Like, okay, okay um, uh, th- 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 thank you. Uh, he takes it and just like, uh, don't tell him where I went. He just starts scaling one of the walls and hides. Okay. And then he goes to the season. He's like, whoa, what's the, uh, hold your horses. What's, where's the fire? Bongo's like, like, I am going to kill your son. It's like, oh, hell no. I just got him back. I am not losing him. Especially you, Sparkles. It's like, what? It's like, you, yeah. You don't know what he did, did you? No. Mm, what do you do? Apparently, he's already had his first kiss, and it wasn't what uh, that woman, uh, Tigress. Okay, what well, was it with one of you guys? Oh God, don't tell me it was with you. It's like, oh fuck no! I right now, I'm, right now, I'm pissed at that that pussy. Like he was just cringing, like. Enough with the fucking cat jokes. It's like, it's like okay, fine. What? Who was his first kiss? Like, it was with my mom on the cheek. It's like, what? It's like, yeah. So you can see why I want to marry your your little bastard. Like, oh, okay. I'm gonna have a talk with you. your mom later on. As for where Izuku is, she looks up. So Deku looks at her like, "Oh, mom, don't do me like that. Come on, man. Come on, man. You you supposed to be my protector." She she, she has a devilish grin that suddenly turns to a scowl as she gives him the evil eye. So he's up there. He he was hiding from you. He didn't tell me why, but thanks for the information. Go, you can. He's all yours. Do with him as you wish. But as long as he's alive, I don't care. Like, oh damn, I've been betrayed. And, and Bakugo, he is like, oh, I'm going to enjoy this so much. And he shoots up. They're using explosions and launches Deku out the window. Deku lands on his feet because duh. And he starts running around campus trying to avoid all the murderous mob that's after him. And, and that's pretty much his whole day. Class has already ended. and Right now, he's just trying to survive the rest of his day until he can actually get home, which he knows Hagakure is going to be waiting for him regardless. And I think I should end it off there. Oh, wait, what the hell? Oh, but seriously, I decided to give y'all a little comedy in this part. But seriously, y'all need to stop guessing what I'm about to do next, because some, some of y'all are very good at guessing. I don't know how, I don't know, I don't know if y'all could read minds or nothing, but yikes. Y'all, uh, but anyway, yeah, I am out. The peace and the love, children. Stop guessing what I'm going to do next. You're getting too good at it.